Hey guys, it's today we're up and I'm here. We're gonna build a lightsaber at Sabi's workshop here at Galaxy's Edge in Disneyland. So I'm really excited. We've never done it before. Hey, let's get into it. You're watching Today I Grew Up. Today's the day, guys. I'm gonna build a lightsaber at Galaxy's Edge, something I've wanted to do for a long time. I customized a Star Wars jacket for this special occasion. On the sleeve, I decided to put um, a Star Wars logo and may the force be with you. Cut it out from a hoodie, and then it was sewn on with a sewing machine. So basically, I'm gonna be walking around with a giant back patch on the back of this denim jacket. So I'm really happy with this jacket and how it came out. Just check it out, I found R2-D2. I think he's hibernating right now. He's probably sleeping or recharging, so. But yeah, it's cool, we found him. Okay, the last one. Okay, cool. And then which one are you building today? Um, I'm gonna go with uh, Peace and Justice. I'm the last one. Mm -hmm. Wow, that's cool. <laughs> So if you build a lightsaber for peace and justice, you get this exclusive pin at Savi's workshop. So basically guys, I waited a whole year to build this lightsaber and all of a sudden Buddy from Cake Boss comes and takes over and we had to wait and delayed our appointment. So we had to watch Buddy from Cake Boss film an episode and I was like, you know what, Buddy, you're lucky I like you and I like your show because I was getting mad. I was like, dude, I paid $200 and I waited a whole year and now I have to wait to build my lightsaber because Buddy from Cake Boss took over. So t check out that footage. Hey guys, Buddy Velastro here and I am going to show you how to make a really cool galaxy cake. Kind of Star Wars-esque. I mean, look, I loved Star Wars as a kid growing up and I'm still into the movies. Whenever the movies come out, I gotta go see it. I'm a big fan. So this is a little Star Wars inspiration. <laughs> Lightsaber is a lost ancient art form. 
but we have preserved that for all of you. We believe by preserving our past, we just may well ensure our future. And as with any journey, we must begin somewhere. Ours will begin with this, your Kyber crystal. Now the Kyber crystal is the heart to your lightsaber. It channels, of course, and magnifies and intensifies the power. And the color of your crystal will depict the color of your blade. Well, there may be many colors out there, but together, the gatherers have collected four for you. Four, beginning with blue. Once wielded by Master Obi-Wan Kenobi, his young apprentice, Anakin Skywalker, and now Rey, spark of hope. <laughs> Green, Qui-Gon Jinn, Ahsoka Tano, Master Yoda himself, and Luke Skywalker. Violet, most rare and beautiful amongst the galaxy, wielded by Master Mace Windu. And the red. Some call it the crystal of power. Darth Vader, Maul, Asajj Ventress. And now it is held by Kylo Ren. The builders, most of these the legends of the past and we're here for you our future so please builders may have all of you close your eyes close your eyes clear your minds and think deep down inside which color calls to you hold on to that color and preserve it into your heart for the kyber crystals the heart of your lightsaber now builders open your eyes and reach out for the color that you have held on to You'll need a place to harness your Kyber crystal. So the gatherers and myself will be going around asking questions along the way. The gatherers and myself are here to assist you. So builders, are you ready to build? Yes. yes. Yeah. Okay, let's build. All right, builders, we're going to start your task and take your Kyber crystal. So Kyber crystal. Now, if you like it, you're not playing under the window. But if it does, it will then light. But now we light up and come for you. You can even spin it, which is really cool. So it's snapped into place now. If you can rotate it and it doesn't move, then you did a good job. This is a switch that I have. This is a really cool switch. I'm gonna go with this one. Top, push down, tighten to the left, bottom, push up to the right. So I'm gonna go with this one for the top. Um, actually, I'm gonna go with the other one. I like this one because it's a thicker black band. And you're just going to tighten both of the grips. So tighten that. I like this because it looks like uh, Luke Skywalker's a little bit. So put that here. There you go. Oh, it's good. And then for the emitter, I like this one because it looks like Luke Skywalker's too, kind of like a Jedi. Classic Jedi. Looks good. And then the bottom, I like the black because then it gives it more of a sleek look. And I like this one too because the D-ring is on the edge of it. On this one, the D-ring's in the center. Um, so for the belt clip purposes, I'd rather it be on the edge. Hanging off, then in the middle. I think once I'm done, I put it here. <laughs> May I check you now? Yes. <laughs> All right, when it's time to activate, you're just gonna press up on that lever, okay? okay? Good Thank job. You. Thank you. Guys, I just built my lightsaber here at Sabi's workshop. It came out really nice. And um, blue kyber crystal because I'm on the light side. But we're going to fire it up soon, so I'm really stoked. So for now, the crystal needs to stabilize. Let's see what happens next. We're 
more sensitive. I gotta you, not too long ago. So we rely on technology to do this. Let me touch your now. Join the arm. Yes. Light saber. It begins. It is time. Your journey. Wow. Master Yoda. Truly, you must be the one called here by the Force today. Builders, in just a moment. I will have all of you, together as one, forge a bond between Builder and Saber to Force. But the Force is strongest when we work together. So please, take a large step forward. Place your hand upon your hilt. Take a deep breath, focus, and activate. Raise your sabers high. For you have just created a lightsaber. Just like the Jedi and Sith that come before you. And like them, you too can change the galaxy. But remember, it only takes a heart. Raise them high and proud, builders.
made it out. So I made it back and I got a yellow kyber crystal and there it is. There is the crystal, which is awesome. Um, so we're gonna take, there's a springy part that I'm gonna pull apart. So this was my blue kyber crystal. You hear that? So it kind of made this sound like it's been activated. So. I think because we can spin it and it's stabilized in there that it's ready to go. Now let's see if this is yellow. Awesome. So cool. And it makes a different sound. You can hear that. Strike feature. So it also kind of like changes color. So also changes like a white color on the strike feature. So that's really, really cool. Now what's really cool about this is that when I hit the blue lightsaber, it flashes uh, almost, it's hard to see on camera, but it almost looks like a yellow color or a white color. It looks white there, but sometimes it looks yellow. So the strike feature looks really cool. I love that. As always guys, thank you guys for watching, thank you for subscribing, thank you for liking, and uh, I had a great time today building a lightsaber. So I'll see you guys in the next video review.